Thank you. Local health officials believe we are just past the peak of respiratory virus season. News 5's Patrick Musinak joins us now to explain why parents still, though, need to take precautions when it comes to their children's health. Patrick. Diane, they certainly do because respiratory viruses include COVID-19, RSV, and the flu. Doctors say there's still plenty of this to go around. For months now, doctors, especially pediatricians, have been keeping a close watch on a number of young patients coming in to be treated for a respiratory virus. Good news is, recently, less children have been ending up at the doctor's office. It's important still to vaccinate your children. Take those precautions of keeping them home when they're sick and making sure that you're using good respiratory hygiene. Those are the very precautions yep. Josh Coffey and his wife use for their three sons. Coffey says they take it a step further. Oh, that's a big yeah, I would say the biggest thing is frequent hand washing. Uh, got, their, got to keep their hands clean. Uh, you know, we're obviously we're caught up in all of our vaccinations. We take vitamins on a daily basis. Coffee says he even allows his children to play with others, but they haven't been sick so far this season. Just yesterday, we were at the mall at the um, uh, playing and at the playground. So you know, just keeping you know hand sanitizer on me and then wipes as well, um, just to make sure that we can do everything that we can to mitigate it. Since October, the State Department of Health reports more than 2,200 cases of the flu in Colorado, more than 4,800 COVID-19 cases, and just over 2,100 cases of RSV. But officials believe the peak is over. The number of hospitalizations for all three of those diseases are decreasing at this point in time. Symptoms for these respiratory viruses include coughing, sneezing, and sore throat, just to name a few. Now, if you notice these, doctors say, Call your child's pediatrician. Alex.